the fifth at over 100, accelerating and soft, braking at about 150 yards. Straight down into third. The one that tightens up hard through the second one. A little bit of opposite lock on the way out under power. Up into fourth, back in fourth, a little bit of opposite lock again. Braking hard for this left hander. Stay out a bit. Tightens up a lot here. Down into second for the right hander. Plenty of power. Slides nice out of this corner. 9,000 in second. Flat through this left hander in third. Up to 9,000. Changing to fourth. Doing about just over 100 here. Breaking for the fast right. Through the fast right in fourth. Breaks very hard for this tight right hander. Quite a slippery corner that. Into fourth. Downhill very fast. Breaking very hard down here. Down to second. Power on to the left hander. Opposite lock a bit there. Let's see. 9,000 in second. Stay in third. Just reaches nine here. Through the first part. Break for the second part. Tightens up a lot. Slides again a bit there. This is the fast right hander before the straight. It's flat in fourth. Slides a little bit on the way out. Couple of slow cars here. Into fifth. Past the fifth. Acknowledge the fifth signal. 130 on the straight, breaking hard for the right hand at the end of the straight. straight down 135 the miles an hour in a Ford Escort. Well, not the kind of antics you'd adopt in the high street, I'm quite sure, but this car is a second cousin to the one in which you could get a parking ticket just outside the butcher's shop. The difference is it's race prepared, one of 32 cars that will fight it out in less than an hour from now in the final round of the European Saloon Car Championships on this Jurama circuit just outside Madrid. Four hours racing that will decide two major titles, the Manufacturer's Trophy and the Drivers' Championship. The Manufacturer's Trophy looks as if it may be won by Alfa Romeo. Cars competing in this race are classified into three divisions. A division 1 for the little ones, a Division 2 for the bigger ones, and Division 3 for the really hairy monsters like the big Ford Capris. Alfa leads in Division 1 and 2 with 58 points in each. Fords are their nearest rivals with 55 points in Division 3. And Alphas are favourites because the trophy goes to the manufacturers with the most points in any one division. And this also applies to the Drivers' Championship. And leading the field here is Dieter Glemser in a Ford Capri. With five wins out of seven starts, he has a three-point lead. But to take the title, he must win his division in this race.